वेलकम टू जावा इन यूर वर्ड्स ट्यूटोरियल दिस इज एपिस नंबर टेवल शॉर्ट सर्किट लॉजिकल ऑपरेटर्स सो प्लीज सी द लेफ्ट हैंड साइड ऑफ दिस वाइट वाइट बोर्ड द फर्स्ट ऑपरेटर इज डबल एम्पर साइन दैट इज शॉर्ट सर्किट लॉजिकल एंड एन अनदर ऑपरेटर इज डबल पाइप साइन दैट इज शॉर्ट सर्किट लॉजिकल और सो दीज आर द बुलियन ऑपरेटर्स वी आर कॉलिंग दिस एज द सेकेंडरी वर्जन ऑफ बुलियन बुलियन एंड एंड और ऑपरेटर If we use the OR operator, it results into true if the first expression is evaluated to uh, evaluated to true, no matter what the what is the result of the second expression. If you use the AND operator, it results into false false when first expression is evaluated to false, no matter what what is the result of second expression. so instead of this short uh, instead of this logical and and or operator if we use this log, uh, short circuit logical and and short circuit logical or then it is very beneficial for us for example you just check the example which is given in the right side of that uh, white board first example is if number 2 is not equal to 0 then short circuit logical and if number 1 divided by number 2 is greater than 5 in this example if the result of first expression number 2 is not equal to 0 if the result of the first expression is false then not necessary to check the result of the second expression because ultimately it results into the false and the runtime exception will not be generated same similar way you just see the second example which is where we have used short circuit logical or operator if if a is greater than 30 or the short circuit logical or mars greater than 60 in this case if the first expression a is greater than 30 becomes true then not necessary to check the second expression because because ultimately it results into true so instead of the short circuit logical and and short circuit logical or if we use logical and logical or operator then it is necessary to evaluate the second expression also so if you go for short circuit logical operators not necessary to evaluate the second expressions so we'll see remaining operators later on thank you